Howdy folks, it's General Heed here. How's everyone doing today? So, for today's video, we'll be tackling the new Call of Duty Modern Warfare again, but this time with a really cool glitch that you can do. It's actually super useful in uh, Spec Ops. Actually, it only works in Spec Ops uh, at the moment, as far as I know. And it's also probably a glitch that will probably get patched eventually as well. But for the moment, you can enjoy this glitch and uh, it'll probably help you a lot in Spec Ops too. So this glitch is to remote control any vehicle, and while doing that, you'll be totally invisible to uh, all AIs. So, as you can see, right now it's uh, Photo Chaos, my friend that did it first. You can see he's driving this vehicle, but there's actually no one in the driver's seat right now. He's completely remote controlling it. So, here's how you do it. You need to get into the driver's seat first, if you're the one that wants a remote control. And, you will need a friend to help you out. You need to... Uh, run them over first with a vehicle, or they can blow themselves up with a grenade as well. However, I don't recommend the second one, uh, just because sometimes if they do it too close to the vehicle, it'll damage the explosion will damage it, and you know it's best to have more health if possible with the vehicle. But once they're downed, just revive them while next to the vehicle. Make sure you can see the option to enter the vehicle. Once they're revived, quickly, immediately get into the vehicle, like I just did there, right after you revive them, and that's it. Very easy to do. Just uh, once you do that, just quickly, just drive forward. <laughs> um, just keep your body like off the vehicle, uh, unless you want to bring your body with you. But yeah, you'll just be in a driverless vehicle and controlling it. And as for the enemy AIs, they won't they won't be able to see you at all. They uh, <laughs> they just don't see anything suspicious about a vehicle driving itself around. So they just kind of completely ignore you. They won't shoot at you at all. So you can use your vehicle to splatter them. And actually, um. The vehicles in Call of Duty, they're kind of, they kind of have like Halo 1 physics actually with like the Warthogs. Um, like a, a simple tap is enough to like splatter pretty much any enemy. Uh, so it's a, it's a very like OP like weapon to use essentially against enemies. And like I said, it works with any vehicles too. You can also do it with the, uh, the helicopter as well. Now this one you gotta be careful because when you get in, your body's always on like the side of it. So you want to kind of shake your body off. Um, otherwise, if you bring your body with you, it'll be like standing like just off the ledge, and if it falls off, you will die. That's right. Uh, this glitch only works as long as like your original body is still alive. If something happens to your original body, um, then you will your helicopter basically explode and you'll die instantly. Uh, or if the helicopter is destroyed, your body will. Um, teleport to it, but you know, you'll still be dead, essentially. Or you might survive sometimes, but either way, you just teleport to wherever your vehicle is at the time this happens. So, when you do this glitch, make sure your body is somewhere safe, because while your vehicle that you're controlling is invisible to AIs, uh, your body is not, and they will still attack your body. <laughs> so if your body dies, it will ruin this glitch. So just find somewhere safe to hide and do it. Uh, or have someone protect your body, but it's it's just easier to hide somewhere while doing this Maybe like inside a building or Somewhere or like I said, you can even use the vehicle to move your body around later uh, But yeah, so as you can see all the enemies just die instantly when they touch my vehicle um, The last vehicle I think we could do this with is um, This one here. I believe there's also like a tank you could do on this mission I haven't done all the spec ops missions yet, so I think there's more vehicles than just these three but it doesn't matter what vehicle, it's the glitch is the same, you know, just down your teammate somehow, revive them, and immediately get in. And that's it, the glitch works. So, you should be able to remote control any vehicle, and on missions where, like, there's a lot of enemies, or, like, lots of waves of them, it is very useful, because your teammates can just hide while you just, you know, drive around and splatter all the enemies, and they will never shoot at you or react to you at all. Uh, it's, just, it's just, you know, to them, there's just nothing wrong with a vehicle driving itself around. I guess this game takes place, like, I guess, yeah, I guess Modern Warfare takes place slightly in the future, where, like, self-driving cars are uh, more um, ubiquitous or more common. So that's why all these uh, enemies, they don't, they don't find anything strange about a vehicle driving around with no driver in it. Uh, but yeah, so it's a really cool glitch found by my friends uh, Photos Chaos and A11YT. Uh, so... Shout out to them. Good job, guys. Uh, but aside from that, if you guys enjoyed this video, found it to be interesting or even useful, make sure to leave a like. Uh, leave your thoughts and comments. Uh, if there's you know 
anything else for me to check out or look into in Call of Duty, Modern Warfare, or any other game like Halo and so on, just let me know, and I'll do my best to check it out. But other than that, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe, and I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.